Hi, I'm Rob Robel out of CarcadeCarpenter.com. I'm here in Udine, Italy to visit the Irwin state-of-the-art saw blade making facility. Let's go inside and check it out. The facility that makes the Irwin blades was immaculate and you could literally eat off the floors. They use a really good quality strip steel and they check it for flatness, thickness, and hardness before the sheet stock is placed into a nitrogen laser cutter called a hypergear machine where they actually cut the blade blanks out of. This is a completely automated process and is done with absolute precision. Once the blade blanks are cut out, they are then sent into an oven that's heated up to 450 degrees. The oven can take up to 500 blades and the process is to eliminate tensions in the blade by the laser cutting. The next step for the blade is, is a wet grinding to polish it and eliminate burrs. Then it's off to be tensioned. This process involves 50 tons of pressure by steel rollers, which basically flattens the blade and maintains its tension. From there, the blade has to be balanced and maintained and checked for flatness. It's a very manual process and it's done to maintain really tight tolerances. This next step was my favorite. It was the tip brazing. It's where they apply the carbide teeth to the blade. It's an induction tip brazing that uses a silver copper silver method and the machine skips every other tooth in order to keep the blade flat, which I thought was very interesting. It also has a slow heating and cooling method to keep the blade strength and resiliency. Once this is complete, the blades are then sent off for sandblasting and a Teflon coating. The sandblasting will clean the brazing and the marks off the blade prior to the Teflon coating. And then the Teflon coating is applied to the blade, which is that Irwin blue that we see. The special coating that they apply is a heat resistant non-stick coating that actually helps reduce gumming and hopefully gives you a cleaner, more truer cut. These blades are clearly made for a user who demands quality and precision in their cutting. The manufacturing plant was super impressive. They obviously are using premium materials and manufacturing techniques and some of the most advanced saw blade technology there is. And they're making sure that these Irwin blades are held to a higher and stricter tolerance than their competitors. Well done.